The rich and powerful made this their home for centuries. When we came here on a high school field trip, I thought I could still smell the open hearth. The wine, the suckling pig, the blood. Not much for lords to do, and there's no war or political intrigue to amuse them. So blood kept flowing in their halls. They tortured and killed anyone who displeased them. To make an example of them, or simply for entertainment. Then, the castle fell into disrepair. And, anyway, the times were changing. The rich and powerful built themselves new palaces. This place stood abandoned for centuries. Though passers-by would sometimes squat amidst the ruins. Bandits, vagabonds, children without parents. A band of partisans stayed here briefly during World War II. They all died here. In the 50s, the Soviet government finally noticed the castle and turned it into a museum. And now, now this is all that's left. Can't smell the blood of past centuries anymore. Can't smell anything human. I wouldn't call myself religious, but maybe we're paying for the sins of the past. For all the sins of humankind.
Wow, I can see the whole town from up here. Come on, Katya, hold on to the rocks. I can't, this thing is wobbly. I'm scared. 